Um, I'm the founder and director of sustainable fine jewelry brand, Matilde Jewelry. A day in my life tends to differ quite a bit, but today looks like this. This is what I'm doing today. We've been shooting our International Women's Day campaign and met with some amazing and so inspirational women um, all over London and kind of finishing off the day doing this with me. So it kind of varies, but this is what it could look like. And tomorrow I'll probably be catching up on emails, so yeah. I know this is gonna be the super cliche answer, but I obviously have to say my mom, who's here as well watching this. Um, but yeah, absolutely, my mom. I'm so inspired every day by everything she does, by her morals, by her values, by the way she leads her life. And yeah, definitely the most inspirational. I think there's a lot of back and forth on International Women's Day, and so many people say that the fact that we have this day shows that we're definitely not where we want to be because there's no International Men's Day, for example. But I think it's, I like to see it as opposed to looking at the negatives of it. I like to use it as a day to really highlight inspirational women and, and just women all over the world and what we're doing and what we could still, do, what we could be doing more and kind of, yeah, kind of just highlighting the amazing things women can do. I think I try to be an inspiration to other women um, just by kind of being true to myself. If I, if I really do everything with love and passion and hard work, I think, yeah, I just try to really st stay true to what I believe in and everything that I do. I would say a life mantra that I don't live by, but I want to live by, is it is what it is. Um, I know that sounds funny, but there's so many things in my life. I try to control everything, and I'm really gonna try to practice letting go of what I can't control and really allowing those things to just be. Kind of all over the place sometimes. I would say, in general, it's quite minimal, timeless, and quite classic. But then on other days, it's super eclectic and a mix of loads of different things. So I think it, my style is a reflection of how I feel on that day. Yeah. Um, definitely earrings and piercings. As you can see, I'm all stacked up. I don't think I have any more space to add any more. Um, so definitely I love earrings. I love to layer it up and just kind of curate what my ear looks like. I love that. Um, but I also love some good rings, so yeah, depends. Probably say those two things. Um, my own, because it just has Matilda jewelry, obviously. I think every, every jewelry piece that I own has some sort of sentiment to it. I think that's what makes jewelry so special. So it kind of changes, but at the moment I'm wearing this one ring. It's the only thing I'm wearing that's not Matilda jewelry. Um, and it's been passed down from my mom, and I just love it, I wear it every day. I think what makes me feel the most empowered is surrounding myself with people, not just women, but family, friends, just people in your life that are really supportive of, of what you do and kind of make you feel empowered by that. I think being surrounded by people that really support you is empowering. Um, at the moment, again, it differs because I love all of them. Obviously, I'm biased, but at the moment, I'm really liking the Galaxia ring. I'm wearing it, and I don't know, I just love it. It's so quite dainty, but quite fun and versatile as well. So that would be my favorite piece at the moment. <laughs>